Hi Capricorn, love the light to you here. Welcome to your reading. We're here with your full moon in Sagittarius, leading up to the new moon in Cancer. Let's get into it here for you. You can are strongly in the Libra reading. And uh, let's see here though what comes through for you, Capricorn. And uh, it's funny, I was mentioning your energy right you on the camera and I was like hearing this specifically, like just let it go, let it go, leave it. It doesn't matter. I'm hearing that like specifically. Um, so for Nuri, maybe there's something that you feel like you've realized, like maybe even the, the, the relationship too in some way. You're thinking, you know, it's not worth kind of like considering and calling out as something uh, I'm hearing other than also what is felt for it. Wow, very interesting. Daughter of Wands here, actually coming through in reverse. For Nuri, this is something that you feel you've really been considering over time here. It has a lot of potential. So you may feel it, dear Capricorn, and um, it's interesting. Positive for Nuri is something that you realize also how you would like to invest in the space of devil coming through in reverse in the first part of this period. I'm going to be pulling cards for each of the days. The devil here in reverse around the 5th of June. We had that full moon in Sagittarius culminating for us. Now, Remember right as well that all readings they may culminate in a six month period, even about a year. Now we have the devil in reverse. Remember, you see if you're like really eager to get something like going, you're like, oh, hurry, I want to just yeah, so I want, I want to get it like going. I'm hearing that like specifically, maybe even like you're talking to a number of people. Let's clear that. You're having like multiple conversations. Even there's something maybe building. It's getting kind of like complex though. I'm hearing that specifically, Mother of Pentacles. I'm hearing, I know you want to ride out. Like you want to, you want to continue some cycle. Like I'm hearing. To the end. I'm hearing to the end of the road. Two of Wands coming through. This kind of looks like a road as well. I'm hearing Sagittarius, Leo, Capricorn, Aries. I'm hearing that as well. I'm hearing Cleopatra very strongly with the Mother of Pentacles and the Devil with the Son of Wands. Now, for a number, this is something physically that you want to like. You start. You want to generate. You want to build up. For a number, I'm hearing you want to. You want to increase. I'm hearing your energy levels this way, or there is a focus on the sustaining of energy over time. Maybe the Daughter of Pentacles in reverse. There's something that you're even trying out for. I don't know what. The, maybe even interviewing. Something that you're like training on even, Daughter of Pentacles looking in the future, the lovers as well, has to do with some kind of contract maybe, it could be a decision that you eventually feel you will, you will be making out, Daughter of Swords here, I just Daughter of Swords, Son of Swords that you will be making, you'll make a decision here, maybe even something that you'll be registering for, the Hangman as well. No, it's funny because I was going to say, <clears throat> in the Pisces reading for this extended series, Pisces came through with their own card, the Hangman, as a first card, and you're coming out with your own card, the Devil. So, for a number of you, it could be a very strong focus on that reading, even, or you know, it could be for the clues there in that reading for you. But specifically with a Pisces, you deal with the Pisces for me. You're dealing with someone's very mysterious. It's there's a really strong connection, though, very strong. You feel like you guys just get each other. Ten of Swords in reverse, at the base of the Mother of Swords upright, Father of Pentacles upright, at the base of the Two of Wands. For a I'm hearing that song again. But to the end of the road, like someone's like so, they're like. What if, I'm hearing, uh, I'm hearing Candyman. I'm here because I'm a love man. What's that song from Dirty Dancing? Nine of well, Wands upright. Patrick Swayze, right? Nine of Pentacles here at the base of the Son of Swords. Two of Cups upright at the base of the Hanged Man. I'm hearing Hermit very strongly feeling some pressure on the throat. Nine of Swords upright at the base of the Ten of Swords in reverse. Eight of Pentacles here at the base of the Father of Pentacles. Five of Pentacles at the base of the Four of Pentacles. We're going to you're building something, actually. Like, maybe you feel like you're building your resume. Five, a Ten of Wands in reverse. Very exhausting, though. <laughs> okay, Emperor as well. Look at Ten of Wands. Like, something, something is just kind of, like, cool here leading you out. In your theme. For a number of you, uh, I'm hearing... I think I think she's the one. I'm hearing that as well. <laughs> With a hangman and the Two of Cups. Um, I think she's, like... She see, she's seeing me. Seeing her also like that. I'm hearing that as well. Uh, for a number of you, someone is realizing that it's also at a point of no return. <laughs> I'm really like, anyway, like, uh, I'm in love. I'm hearing that, like, again, Capricorn, okay. <laughs> now, we have lovers, like, looking in the future. Someone is, is has has really, I'm hearing there's a lot of passion here. A lot of passion. I the Eight of Pentacles, and the Two of Cups. This is something where there is, like, a history here, baby, okay? I'm hearing, actually, maybe even we have the Mother of Pentacles, could be, like, a mother and a child sort of feeling. Mother of Pentacles, you're the apex of the spread um, with the Two of Cups and the Eight of Pentacles anchoring. I'm hearing her reign. I don't know why that was only two, but maybe for reason is something that you've been really fascinated even by. I'm hearing the discussion of, I'm hearing the connection to, and you have the, the Father of Pentacles today, I don't know, Mother of Pentacles here. Uh, Mother of Pentacles here, Diana with the Hangman. So for an there's some kind of connection here that you feel possibly there's overlap even on an emotional level, possible even on, on a sentimental level, even in terms of your finances, which is very interesting. Maybe this is an industry that you feel sentimental about in some way, and uh, it holds meaning for you on so many different levels. Now, for a number of you, possibly as well, this is something that you're actually building physically, and you're like putting your blood, sweat, and tears into it. It's like your labor. It's a labor of love. And it's something that maybe even you're manufacturing, you're crafting, you're using your hands. I'm seeing wood here for a number of you. So 
Um, and Frederick is something you have you have experience in, and you had experience in the in 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 the industry of in the industry space of for like quite some time now. And I'm focusing on this hat as well. I'm here craft crafting something. Okay, very interesting. Now the five pentacles sort of this has to do with, as well with scripture or something that you inscribe. It's very interesting. Like I'm seeing someone chiseling away at wood even. Very interesting. And I see there's something even symbolic that's etched into that. I'm here in stone as well. Eight of Pentacles with the Five Pentacles. I'm here at Stonehenge. For no reason, this is even a space of history. Maybe even that you feel you're kind of like revealing. And I got this little tickle on the back of my uh, of, of my spine. So I don't know, Pisces. I'm here at Pisces for a number of you. It's like, you, listen, you have some sort of like ancient. I'm hearing you feel like you have a heart-to-heart -heart connection as well in some space that is so clear now i'm here as well in a way where you're like there's no point in like defiant defying this why would i <laughs> it's like the emperor of the two of cups like why say that the story unfolds like in a way that is not loving i'm hearing that as well like why say that this is also not something that i that i that i feel for in that way so for a number of you there's been this feeling of also tension perhaps in the space of saying i want to participate in this of, of, I'm hearing officially even if it is let's say eventually it's like officially why not you know communicate at least that interest so now and what I'm seeing as well for a number of you is that there's a little bit of pressure possibly when it gets to that point of even feeling like when you feel like you kind of get closer to the conversation about um even I'm hearing the the, car the carrying out of the space I'm hearing an official way it it, it it feels like something that is tense and I'm seeing that partly that is because of the sort of buildup of passion for a number of you, for a number of you, not for every general reading, of course, and um, if you're watching specifically, it depends on what you're watching, all right, as well, possibly, if you're watching for matters related to love, or partial property, beauty, contracts, soul contracts, even finances, financial contracts as well, soulmates, soulmate, soulmate contracts, you might want to watch your Venus sign, so um, in addition, the sign that, that rules the house, naturally, that your Venus is in, so let's say your Venus is in the fourth house, you want to watch, you know, Cancer, given that Cancer naturally rules the fourth house, but in addition, the sign that your Venus is in, so let's say Venus and Aries in the fourth, you might want to watch Aries, you might want to watch Cancer, so take it as you will, Capricorn, but just some viewing tips there. I found that actually my Venus sign really resonates a whole lot in addition to my Mars sign overall. And so, um, you know, Mars is our sort of our will to, to move forward in a certain way. So for a review, you, you know, there could be focus as well on the physical body. Um, how it is that you're presenting something in a public way? And especially if this is related to your career, how it is that you're publicly representing that space? Now, for a review, though, there's a lot of history here and it goes way deep. We're talking like, there's a lot of history here. I'm here and it's passionate. And that possibly for a review, um, is sort of charging this connection. I'm hearing that as well, potentially, where you feel like, wow, I feel like there's a lot, there are a lot of problems. I'm hearing a lot, a lot of, is like very, well, can we say karmic kind of, but there's a lot like to the space where I feel like we're not just like, you know, suddenly also uh, mirroring one another. I'm hearing like that, I don't know, I'm seeing mirroring here with the two of wands. Very interesting, actually. Mirroring the lovers, actually. Um, with the Dog Pentacles in reverse. And so for an area, someone's like, kind of, they're on the verge of perhaps even carrying the space out. And it can be communicating on behalf of a certain idea that the vision that they've had, also on an emotional level, even spiritually, uh, psychically, energetically. And so, uh, for a number of you, um, you know, emotionally, there is something that you kind of like, maybe you kind of like have started to pick up on. Or